Well, it was important because for the first time uh, it provided those individuals within a society that care about a human rights something that they could hold their government accountable to, even though their government, for instance, may not have really thought uh, that much about signing on to particular covenants or treaties. So they, uh, you know, countries like Kazakhstan, for instance, have signed on to almost every major human rights covenant that exists to prevent torture, uh, the ICCPR, the International Covenant on Civil and Political Rights. Um, it doesn't mean that those countries are automatically going to change their behavior and start respecting all of those rights. But the fact that they have endorsed and signed on to these treaties gives uh, the individuals within that country, as well as individuals with outs uh, outside of it, um, a pressure point. They can apply pressure on those countries and say, you have yourself uh, signed up and prescribed to respect these fundamental rights and we're going to try now to hold, this to you, hold you to these. It makes it much more difficult uh, for them to at least overtly uh, deny uh, that, they, that they should be living up to uh, the obligations that they've signed themselves up to.